Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we have given the eigenvectors of a 3 by 3 real matrix corresponding to the eigenvalues 2, 3, 6 are this. Using this, we have to find the matrix A. By orthogonal transformation, we already know the formula for the diagonalization of the matrix which is D equal to N transpose A N. Now, I am going to pre-multiply this entire expression by N. So, this will become N D equal to N N transpose A N. Again, I am going to post multiply with N transpose on both the sides. You get like this. Then, since it is an orthogonal matrix, N into N transpose or N transpose into N is identity matrix. So, N D N transpose will become this is I, this is I. So, we represent it by a separate bracket like this and finally, we left with only A. So, this is our formula for finding the matrix A. A is N D N transpose. Now, using the eigenvectors and eigenvalues, we are going to frame this N D and N transpose. First thing, N, which is a normalized matrix got from the eigenvectors. So, we take the first eigenvector and its magnitude is root 2. That is root of 1 square plus minus 1 whole square. Totally root 2. And this magnitude is root of 1 square plus 1 square plus 1 square, which is root 3. And uh, this magnitude is 1 plus 4 plus 1, which is root 6. So, we are going to divide enter column elements by these magnitude and form the normalized matrix n 1 0 minus 1 so 1 by root 2 0 by root 2 and minus 1 by root 2 0 by root 2 is 0 so 1 0 minus 1 the same way 1 by root 3 all the elements of the second column so 1 by root 3 1 by root 3, 1 by root 3 and the last one is minus 1, 2 minus 1. So, we can take this as minus 1 by root 6, 2 by root 6, minus 1 by root 6. So, we formed the normalized matrix N. The next is D. Diagonal matrix is nothing but formed using the eigenvalues. 2, 3, 6 in the leading diagonal. So, it is 2, 3, 6. The rest of the elements are 0. Then, N transpose is nothing but changing the rows of the N into columns. So, we take the first row. I am going to write it as a first column. So, 1 by root 2. 1 by root 3 minus 1 by root 6. 0, 1 by root 3, 2 by root 6. Minus 1 by root 2, 1 by root 3, minus 1 by root 6. So, we have taken the rows and we have written it as a column for n transpose. So, we are going to multiply this. So, we take a equal to this first matrix we have to copy as it is. Now to multiply these two matrices, we take the first row and we are going to multiply with the corresponding elements of the first column. So this will become 0 into 1 by root 2 is sorry 2 into 1 by root 2 is 2 by root 2 and the rest of the elements are 0. Then coming to the second column everything will become 0. Coming to the third column we get minus 2 by root 2. In the same way we take the second row and multiply with the corresponding elements of each column. So 0, 3 by root 3 then again 0 then 0 again 3 by root 3 0 then again this will be 3 by root 3. Then in the same way, we take the third row and multiply with the corresponding elements of each column. So, minus 6 by 
root 6 then 12 by root 6 then minus 6 by root 6 and after this we are going to multiply these two matrices so the matrix A will be we take this one we take the first row and multiply with the corresponding elements of each column so this will be 2 by 2 then plus 3 by 3 then plus 6 by 6 coming to the second row sorry second column this is 0 plus 3 by root 3 sorry it is 3 by 3 0 3 by 3 minus 12 by 6 coming to the third column minus 2 by 2 plus 3 plus 6 by 6 so the second element is 3 by 3 in the same way we take the second row of elements and multiply the corresponding elements of each column first is 0 plus 3 by 3 minus 12 by 6 then 0 plus 3 by 3 plus 24 by 6 then 0 plus 3 by 3 minus 12 by 6 then in the same way we take the third row and multiply with the corresponding elements we get minus 2 by 2 plus 3 by 3 plus 6 by 6 when the last one is 0 plus 3 by 3 minus 12 by 6 then again the third column we get 0 plus 3 by 3 plus 6 by 6 sorry the first element is 2 by 2 now we are going to simplify this matrix A here we can cancel this so this is 1 this is 1 this is 1 so totally the first element is 3 in the same way this is 1 this is minus 2 so 1 minus 2 is minus 1 similarly this is minus 1 plus 1 gets cancelled and we have only 1 and again here it is 1 minus 2 so minus 1 here it is 1 plus 4 which is 5 again 1 minus 2 minus 1 here minus 1 plus 1 gets cancelled so this is 1 1 minus 2 minus 1 this is 1 plus 1 plus 1 totally 3 this is our required matrix A